How you doing, Pastor Nicholas? Good, how are you? Doing great, man. So how did you get tied up with this merge thing? Well, uh, really after I got saved, I, I worshiped in West Texas with Jake Sanchez. And um, through a series of events, it led me here to Iowa and um, lead pastoring a church here. And I connected with Jake and we really, our, our heart is to see churches come together, uh, break down denominational walls, put aside their uh, organizational differences, theological differences, even style of worship differences, come together in the same place and uh, worship the same Jesus. And that's what we're doing here. You know what, Pastor, you're a young pastor, but God's given you success. You have an incredible story. Uh, that viewers will be able to see of, of different programs. I got to tell you, it's refreshing to see a pastor that catches the vision of other churches come together. That's usually a hard thing to do. Sure. But in this case, uh, Dr. Nicholas, it's not with you. No, 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 no. So um, I, I wasn't raised in church, so I don't have that, I guess that church, church mentality where you have to stick to your own group or you have to, even on Sunday mornings, my, uh, my congregation, our congregation really knows that we're not there to get a whole bunch of people into our unit. We're just there to spread the gospel. So the church is outside of the four walls. It's, it really doesn't matter what church you go to. We're worshiping the same King of Kings. So we should all be on the same page, not just looking out at, you know, growing and building our own brand. Our brand is Jesus and that's who we worship. So that's who we serve. Well, that's yeah. revolutionary, Pastor Nicholas. <laughs> if I lived here, I'd be going to your church. And that's music to the ears of all the people who love Jesus who are not currently in church. There's a pastor right here in Iowa that is a kingdom man. Sure. Now there, there's a merge coming up in Odessa in July. Awesome. What would you say to pastors there as far as being willing to come together and do the same thing? I would say to you pastors, um, just take off your pastor hat for a moment and just realize that at the core you're, you're a believer and we're all on the same page. We're all ministers of the gospel. Uh, forget about getting people into your church. Uh, pray about really that competitive spirit that gets even, I know as a pastor, I know it happens. We think, oh, they're going to steal away our congregants. It's just not about that. It's about building the kingdom. It doesn't matter how many people are there. And when you come together and worship like this and you break through those walls, you're, you're basically uh, telling the enemy to leave because he loves division even within uh, different denominations. We need more pastors like you, Pastor Nicholas. Praise God. God bless you. Thank you very much. Thank you.